Go! Here we are in the autonomous portion. Something happening with 3324U Supernova Hydra starting things out, spinning around. Oh, they're going wild. Three seconds left in this autonomous period. Lots of scores up there for red. Nearly the same for blue, despite the fact that Supernova Hydra seemed to be running the wrong autonomous. Well, it's got two rollers for red, two for blue. Blue is getting the autonomous bonus. Drivers ready. Three, two, one, go. And now we are into full driver control. Minute 42 seconds. They've done this all weekend long. Here goes the shot up high for blue out of 9123X Shanghai Ruan. The other Shanghai team picking up in red, looking to line up their shot, now giving chase to the their partner team. Over on blue, we've got Supernova Hydra lined up to shoot. One, two, and three going up easily. On red, we have AQU, that pink robot there, getting three up high. As we come to a minute, 10 seconds left on the clock, AQU out to collect for more. Their partner also doing the same as Shanghai Rig One goes to play defense. At a minute left, we've got Supernova Hydra hitting Shanghai in the corner. Match loads coming into the play now. Match loads filling up, filling up AQU. The team out of London, United Kingdom, heading back over, looking to score up high, 33-24, waiting for them, looking to pin, stop, trying to stop that score, but they get all three up. 35 seconds to go, and it is even pegging and a nearly completely full field. Two more going up, one goes down on blue, only one disc left on the floor on red. 25 seconds left on the clock. It's a pushing match as we go all four rollers to blue. Rollers coming into play now. 91, 20, 2, 3, 3, X trying to get things over to red, but it's the other Shanghai team blocking them out as we come into the end game now. End game mechanism coming out of red and blue. All four robots extended. Two seconds left, one. That is, does it for the first semifinals. Lots of defense played in that match, but a very clean match nonetheless. It's going to take time for referees to sort this one out. So Grant, back over to you. Thanks so much, George. While those referees are adding that up, I'm joined by Cooper from Vex U Team Send It. Cooper, what's going on, man? How's it going, Grant? Yeah, I'm doing great. How are you doing? Yeah, this is fantastic. I love that match and the strategies going behind. Uh, I don't know if you saw the blue alliance with the disc control. Um, <clears throat> what did you see? I, 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 I'm watching a lot of things at once. What did you see with the Blue Alliance? Yeah, so uh, the Blue Alliance had only eight discs on their side of uh, the autonomous line after the autonomous period, which is like not that many. Um, it's in fact, I mean, less than 10. It's less than 10, yeah. Uh, two filled bots and they, they only have two discs on their side. It's a problem. Uh, but they were able to play a lot of defense uh, with one team and uh, they came back and it's really close here. It looks like red has more more scored discs, okay. um, but we're going to see what it looks like. Awesome. Awesome. Yep. It, it, it's all about those little decisions. So thank you so much, Cooper. Um, we're, looks like we're about set on the NASA field. So Keegan, take it away. Thank you very much, Grant. Back here on the NASA field. We're done with semifinal one. Try the second semifinal to see who moves on to the two out of three world championship. Let's go ahead and meet.